guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm so excited to say that this video, as you probably guessed from the title, is my new room tour. So yeah, I'm super excited to show you. You've probably already seen quite a lot of it from my Snapchat, from my Instagram and it, my Snapchat and Instagram are shown here or in the down bar below. So check those out if you want to keep up to date with everything. But a lot of people have been asking for the proper full room tour and finally, finally it's ready. <laughs> it's ready to reveal and I'm just so excited to show you. It literally only got finished yesterday and I finished tidying it this morning so it's fresh as can be and I'm just really, really excited about it. So I'm gonna jump straight in and yeah, like, comment, subscribe, do all of that jazz and I so happy to be finally releasing this. Don't know what that is, but it happened. So enjoy. Bye. I thought I would start with a little overview of my room just to give you guys an idea of what it looks like kind of from the minute you walk in. So we just got my bed and my wardrobe and my, what is it? What's it called? Makeup dressing table, there we go. <laughs> and my desk and television and yeah. This just shows you what it looks like from the other side. So to the left is my drawers with a lot of my clothes in, and then that shows where the stairs come up into my room, and there's no door on the top of the stairs, it just comes straight into my bedroom. So yeah, it's kind of cool. Here's a bit of a closer up look of my, of my desk, at my desk. <laughs> Don't know what I'm saying. Uh, yeah, I'll go into a little bit more detail later, but this is just what it looks like as a whole. It's super cute. I love the fairy lights. I kind of went mad in Ikea with the fairy lights. And yeah, it's just really close to my bed and it's just it's super, super nice. I'm so excited to show you guys. <laughs> I like can't contain myself, it's ridiculous. My bed frame, the drawers in front of you, and my makeup desk, and the makeup desk mirror are all from Ikea. My wardrobe is from Argos. My desk is from Furniture and Fashion. And I can't remember where the side table is from, but I will make sure that I link it in the description down below. And yeah, just thought I would let you know where all the things are from. <laughs> Here's a slightly closer view of my makeup table, and I will go into a little bit more detail, but oh my gosh, guys, I am obsessed. You can tell I have a lot of makeup. Yeah, it's a bit closer, there we go. <laughs> you can tell I have a lot of makeup, and I just can never have enough I feel and this was a perfect way to display it all and keep it all and the mirror is from Ikea and the desk is also from Ikea and a lot of the pots are again from Ikea because I'm obsessed with Ikea and yeah as you can see the drawer is completely filled with makeup as well and uh, there's my face <laughs> so yeah I just absolutely love this on the left hand side I have all my eyeshadow palettes and contour palettes and then kind of in the middle is highlights and bronzers and all those kind of things and then over to the right is moisturizers and body scrubs and all those kind of things and here's just a closer up I got perfumes on the right I've got loads of all my foundations I have so many foundations in the pots in the corner a couple of more perfumes deodorant all that kind of stuff all the necessities about a million trillion lipsticks because lipstick is my fave and yeah, just all my brushes, couple of succulents, and just lip pencils and eyebrow stuff. And then here on top of my drawers are just a little bits and pieces that I like to keep on there. My printer and of course my Polaroid thing. I don't even know what you would call this, but I absolutely love it. It's got a lot of memories attached to it. And I just think it's a really cute way to display your photographs. Here I have my fan which keeps my room cool at night and my little sunglasses rail and my cancan bag and a random plant. And this is a dream catcher that I got whilst on holiday with my best friend Emma in Mallorca. We went in this crazy little shop and it just had the cutest things so I managed to pick that up there. This is the windowsill right next to my desk. I've just got my incense burner thing and my paintbrushes and a couple of little cactuses and my ring holder. And then this is the windowsill by my makeup table and it's again got more succulents and some tissue paper for when my makeup goes horribly wrong. And yeah, just this little housing display that a family member made, which is really cute. And just another overview of the general room, which I've given a few of already, but it's, I'm just so obsessed guys, I can't help it. And I realise I'm saying obsessed a lot, but I actually am obsessed, so I think it's justified. And look at me in the mirror, I look like such a buffoon. <laughs> oh god, what is my life? So, yeah. 
<laughs> I think it looks really cool. I hope you guys are liking it so far. I know I definitely am. I thought I would give a little display of what my wardrobe actually looked like, seeing as on Instagram it just looks like a giant mirror. So this is just a little insight into what I've got in there. Obviously you can't really see, oh gosh what am I doing? <laughs> but yeah, it's the same on both sides, it's just two compartments with a rail and place for shoes and I just draped the fairy lights over it because I thought it looked really nice and it just gives a nice glow in the evening. This is just my side table, my lamp and the plant and the little cactus are all from Ikea and the lamp is a wireless charging lamp which is pretty awesome. So I use that with a wireless charging case so I don't have to plug my phone in at night. I'll link the side table in the description bar because I can't right now remember where it was from. Uh, the banister of my stairs I use for my bags and my polo hat. Uh, the bag with the Instagram logo was from an Instagram exhibition I was invited to which I was super excited about. And yeah, this is just a close up of my desk. So I've got my laptop, a couple of lenses that I was using to film this video, my Pro Marker pens, my Gorilla Pod, my Polaroid printer, and my microphone, my graphics tablet, which I used to do drawings on, obviously my keyboard, a little fake plant thing, some matches for my candles, and my big computer. And my Gorilla tripod thing I used to put all my headphones on because I always lose my headphones. And yeah, the lamp unfortunately doesn't have a place on the desk right now, so it's just kind of standing on the floor, it looks a bit awkward there. But yeah, and this is just another close up. So I've kind of got all my art stuff hidden away in the back, so there's my watercolours, my sketchbook and a couple of pencil cases, and a Seafret album that I still need to download onto my computer because I'm obsessed with Seafret at the moment. If you haven't heard of them, go check them out, they're really awesome. This is my television and my giant plant that I got from Ikea, which actually it wasn't that expensive. And my PlayStation, which I used to obviously play games on. Little Big Planet is amazing. And yeah, I also watch a lot of Netflix on there. I believe the chair is also Ikea, the see-through chair. I think it's the Tobias chair, um, but yes. And then another close-up of my mirror, my mirror? Of my fan, oh gosh. My fan, which I could not live without because my room gets to about a million degrees in the summertime. And just a massive sunglasses collection. Don't really know how I acquired those, but it happened. And yeah, here's just some of my pillows on my bed. The far left pillow, the fluffy one, the pink one, and the grey one are all from Ikea. And the follow your dream, oh, and the plant one as well in the background, the cream one. And the follow your dreams one is from Dunelm in the UK. My bedspread is from Primark and the the bed throw is also from Ikea, most of my stuff is Ikea. <laughs> I also have my Kankum bag there and all the shoes that don't fit in my wardrobe in a nice little line and a lot of necklaces also hanging with the sunglasses. I really hope you enjoyed the video guys, it was so much fun to film, there was a lot of lens changes and a lot of different working out of angles but I'm really pleased with the outcome and I just love my room so much and I really hope that you love it as much as I do. It just is so annoying that as soon as it gets finished, I'm basically moving off to uni. Uh, it's just so typical. I go to uni on the 24th slash 25th of September, so just over two weeks time, and I am super, super excited. If you made it to the end of this video, and if you're hearing this right now, comment down below and let me know if you'd like to see a uni-based video. I'm going to be doing a uni haul video. I filmed it, I just need to edit it. But if you want to see one on kind of making new friends, confidence, that kind of stuff, I did a video previously, but I could always do an updated one if you guys would be interested. So let me know in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a really awesome day. Love you guys. <laughs>